NPT reports. Aging matters. Any ER physician would tell you that they have a handful of patients they know by first name. And that's the sad truth, is that there are people who come to our ERs regularly over and over again who are looking for pain medication. And we are recognizing that that's a problem and we're trying to do something about it. We started with creating prescription protocols and guidelines that we really disseminated out to all of our staff members and said, this is what we will and will not provide in our emergency departments in terms of pain control. Some of the first steps that we took were that we would not refill lost or stolen opioid prescriptions. Mm -hmm. There are times when absolutely we reach for narcotics first. Severe trauma, patients with um, noticeable fractures, acute painful conditions. It is times where patients are having a chronic symptom, a chronic painful condition, or a, a, a non-objective type of condition where opiates really may not be the best choice. In fact, a recent article showed that Tylenol plus ibuprofen is as effective as Lortab mm -hmm. for pain. And so a lot of it is just changing our patients' perspectives, helping them understand that we know they're in pain, mm -hmm. but there are actually very good alternatives to opiates mm -hmm. that can help with their pain just as well as opiates can. We have actually seen year over year a 60% decrease in how many opioids are being prescribed. That's 60% less opioids on the street for people to abuse, for them to divert, for them to overdose on, to get addicted to. So we consider that a huge win.